Hey y'all, it's Sheree. What's up? I'm here with my oh, <laughs> troll. <laughs> I'm here with my best friend Reese. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, I'm sure you've seen her face, her lovely face, on my Instagram. She's back home for a bit, and we wanted to try out the new Main Choice Pow Collection. I have two of the products right here that I purchased from Alta that took about three weeks to come to the Virgin Islands. But we have them. They're here today. Um, have you tried the main choice? I have not. This is my, this is my first time trying it in line. So you don't support black women? Oh my god, I do! <laughs> god, come for me. Come for me. <laughs> okay, let me just give you a little intro since she doesn't really know more much about the main choice. The main choice has been around for about six years. Um, this is the one of the first collections. Let's address the elephant in the room. Main Choice has been acquired by Mav Beauty Brands that's out of Canada. They're a company that's over Rempure. They're over Mark Anthony hair products. They were acquired back in November. Um, so this is one of the first lines since the acquisition. Um, and well, this and the Amazon line, which is available on Amazon. Um, so I am excited to try these products, but I am kind of disappointed because usually it's silicone free. There's yeah. never any silicones in main choice products. And two of the products in this line have silicones, the conditioner and the deep conditioner. I did want to do the deep conditioner. I didn't want to get the deep conditioner, but it had the methicone at the bottom of the ingredient list. And I wasn't trying to spend $18 for a deep conditioner with silicone because I'm silicone free. You <laughs> <so indifferent. laughs> she doesn't care about silicones. I know a lot of people don't care about silicones. I used to be one of them, but now I do. So I just, I just don't want to buy products that have silicone just for a review. So I'm disappointed in that, but I am happy. I think some people get mad when black brands branch out and they have a white audience. Like people are still mad at Shea People are still mad at Shea Moisture, and people say they're mad at Shea Moisture because of the ingredient changes, but I think people are really mad at Shea Moisture because they feel like Shea Moisture isn't just for us anymore. And I think black companies should be allowed to expand and get, them white and get those too. coins. Exactly. Like, like um, Mav Beauty Brands bought um, Main Choice for like millions and millions and millions of dollars over three years. Like she's about to probably get a, like billions of dollars. Listen, after all the oppression, the least she could do is get some white dollars. Yeah. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I'm fine. I'm fine. Get that money. And um, <laughs> <laughs> she's still leading the brand though. She's still leading the brand even, even though it's been. Down, Childish Gambino. <laughs> <laughs> even though, <laughs> even though um, it's a, a even though she's no longer the full owner, she's still leading the brand. So. Mm -hmm. Um, you can tell that this brand is kind of, if you saw this in, in like Alta, obviously it's in Alta, which is already yeah. kind of white. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so if you saw this in Alta, would you think this is for black people or would you think it's for like all hair types or? Immediately just looking at the packaging, I would go for all hair types. Okay. Just because it has a like, kind of like pop, yeah, pop art vibe to it. Mm -hmm. I don't scream like black woman, African roots. Okay, what do you say is, I feel like if I looked at it, I would think it's more for white women. I wouldn't yeah. just look at this, like besides seeing the black girl on it, I would think. And I would think it's a token black girl for my products. Correct, correct. So, which is different, because usually main choice, like they have like a do it for the fro collection, it's really like black, so you can tell they're really branching out. And there's no problem for that for me, but I, for all hair types, always makes me itch. Yeah. Because How? <laughs> it's kind of impossible. But, um, I mean, we've been talking enough. Let's just get into it. So, this is the POW line. It is products obsessively working. The key ingredients are Venice Bark, Kanka Extract, Plantain Extract, Cinnamon Bark, and Angelica Root. And the owner is on it, and it's pretty cute. So, let's let's get into it. Let's try it out. Um, products, products obsessively working. We'll see about that. Um, there's no main choice leave-in that I love. But I do love the braid out glaze and the Ooh. little buttery gel. It's glitter. Yeah, it also has glitter in it, so it's different. This smells like candy, like childhood, like a now or later. Now or later. Ooh! It's like a now or later. It smells so good. 
It smells good. smell better than the leave-in. Yeah, the leave-in, I don't know what the leave-in smells like. It doesn't smell bad, but it's not as sweet. Kind of like a... And it's very glittery. Like a scented Play-Doh. Oh. Like, you know on the Play-Dohs, I had the yeah. scents with them? Yeah. Like that... You get to like my mother the, was a teacher for small children. <laughs> <laughs> like the yellow one. Mm-hmm. It doesn't like Play-Doh. But the gel smells really good, so... I'm gonna take a on it. Oh, I think it's fine. I think I think we're good enough not to spill everything everywhere. It'll be interesting to see how, even though we're both, I mean, I don't hair type, but I mean, I have kinky hair, right? So it'll be interesting to see, even though we both have kinky hair, we have different types of kinky yeah. hair. So I would we, say you're more, you're kinky, but you're more curly than I am. Okay, I can though. see like you have a like, curl, curl. All these snap, all these snap stuff in here. <laughs> <laughs> but I have a definite more like. Kink. I mean, it'll be interesting yeah. to see how this turns out. So far away from your navel, like, just, 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 <laughs> I need you to come closer. I need you to come closer. Okay, <laughs> okay let's. Oh, we took off the top and everything. Oh, we're still on. I was mm-hmm. like, why is the top off all ghetto and stuff? Okay, so let's see what the texture looks like. Oh, okay. It's looser. Usually, products are very thin, but if you leave it running, it'll kind of run down your hand. Yeah, it's not sweet, but I don't know. It's not bad. Ooh, well, went everywhere. It's fling tree hand. Oh, this feels good. You need to apply it. Feels good. This feels great. I'm excited now. Okay, don't get me hyped for no reason. No, no, no. It feels very softening. I also have fine strands. So do so, I. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so you sign. You see, like, it's, it's, it's like smooth. Yeah, it's. it's sm- apply. Oh, shit. This is why we put the <laughs> Well, we grew in a dozen. Let's put a cat back on. Put a cat back on, y'all. Because I'm making a mess. Yeah, it feels. It's a marshmallow root. Mm-hmm. It feels very smoothing and softening. It's like more than just a leave it's like a detangler as well yeah it's very detangling okay do you usually go in right with your gel or do you apply it all over and then you go no in i'm gel? a definite section by section leave-in gel leave-in gel, okay leave me too okay, okay i was like please girl let's apply the gel <laughs> let's apply the gel now <laughs> yeah this feels amazing and i, I know you do like big tips i can do big tips yeah, I do. I'm I am about to do on the whole bunch of twists, girl. I do like medium, small. Generally, I do small twists because to get the most definition. Yeah. So I'm getting a lot of definition. I mean, honestly, this could work for a wash and go. I am about to do a wash and go, and the video on that is coming soon. But yeah. So we're both gonna do three strand twists, right? Yeah. This is our finished twist. My twiggy twist. Um, I touched her hair. It felt, felt really soft. Um, we can definitely feel the stickiness a bit more, mm-hmm. but it's still, trust me, not as sticky. I have to bring you the other main choice gels. Those are really sticky. I don't know how it's going to last in the humidity. We're in the Virgin Islands, but that's what we're looking like. So we finished twisting our hair. This is what we're looking like. Get a little body, get a little. Get a little soft. So this is what our twists are looking like. 
Um, do you have any thoughts before we? We're gonna air dry it. We're not gonna go. We're not gonna do heat. We're just gonna air dry for like two days and then come back. But do you have any thoughts right now from initial application? Okay, so like I know before we were like raving about the leave-in conditioner, but yeah. that changed. That <laughs> changed. continue to use it. Um, I do like the gel. To me, it's comparable to the um Curls Blueberry Bis Bliss. Sorry, um <laughs> jelly. <laughs> the bliss, the bliss, the bliss. <laughs> The um, jelly, because yeah. that's what I use generally for my twists to okay. um, help hold them. So I'm, I have some promise in this because I feel like it's doing a good job at like one keeping my twist really tight, and then also weighing down my hair to an extent. Because usually when I do my twists, they're not this long. Yeah, and they'll Elongated. continue. Yeah, they'll, they'll continue to shrink well, as they like dry. Guaranteed. But, <laughs> but like for right now, I'm like hopeful. So I'm kind of excited to see how it comes You're happy out. with the elongation right yeah. now. Yeah. And I like the gel. I like the feel of the gel. The leave-in, not so much. I'd probably use the gel with something else. Yeah, the leave-in feels good initially. Like when we first applied it, I feel like we both were like, oh, they did, they did something. And then it was like, it just starts to feel really dry. Like there's not enough moisture. It reminds me of the melanin hair care leave-in where it has the slip, but it may not have the moisture. Um, the gel is actually sticky. <laughs> it's not as sticky as the other main choice gels, but definitely, it's not like my neck is sticky or anything, but my hands are sticky. My neck's sticky. Um, I think she put too much gel. Yeah, I did. And my hair is a bit sticky too, but not as sticky as it normally could be. Um, we can see the glitter on our hair, but it's very, Faint. Yeah. Yeah, you can't really. Nice. I feel like it's gonna look nice once it's taken out, like a nice little shimmer. But it don't look like you just went to like a rave, like a party. Today. Yeah, it don't look. It doesn't look tacky. So that's good. But anyway, see y'all in a little bit. We're done these are the finished results um she wants to be a youtuber so bad <laughs> why are you smiling dog she's like yeah we're done you too smile you know, thumbnail thumbnail um i would say this is one of my most defined twist outs because usually with the like it's very humid in here i cooked dinner tonight and it's very hot and both of our hair, even after taking an hour, 45 minutes or so to get ready, we still have definition, we still have um, body to our hair, it's not it's not frizzed out, which is what usually happens in St. Thomas humidity. So I would say this is one of my most defined twist outs, but unfortunately, the flakes. The flakes, <laughs> the flakes, the winter in July. And it's a lot of flakes. If if I kind of shake too much, or like it's a lot, and I have a lot more than Reese does because she's not as heavy handed. But I will show you all of her shoulders is full of flakes. Um, yeah, yeah, it's it's flaky. <laughs> um, do you have any thoughts? Um, just compounding on what you said, because like normally I my go to product combo is like the curls brand, the Blueberry Bliss, the um, Leave In, and then the twist and shell cream and then whatever the jelly is and I feel like this gave me comparable results so I would go back to this if it wasn't for the flakage yeah. but because it flakes so much I'm just gonna stick with my tried and true what, would you try the gel again? I think I would and try and mix it with something else and see if that makes a difference so do you think the gel gave us flakes or do you think something in the leave-in 
made the gel flake. I think it's something in the combination of these two products, okay. which is always amazing to me. Slow it down, Dolores. Because I feel like if you have two products in the same line, Correct. they should be compatible with one another. And they ain't. Yes. <laughs> I mean, I think we can. I can. I can definitely say that these this product is for all hair types. Well, all natural hair types. I can't speak for straight. I mean, uh, I don't. I don't know. Well, I You're guess you're not here to speak for straight hair. I'm not here to speak for straight hair, girl. Let's be real. <laughs> I'm. I'm rid of everybody black. Okay. Um, I'm black adjacent. <laughs> <laughs> but I can only speak for kinky curly curly hair i think it would work for everyone that has even waves i see this gel if you're light-handed it could work it definitely could work for all hair types but proceed with caution, <laughs> caution. <laughs> because again i think we both are happy with the results in terms of definition alone shine i think both of our hair looks really shiny and it looks healthy there's a luster to it mm -hmm. but and it doesn't feel heavy either. It doesn't, because we were both worried. Our hair was very dry yeah. feeling and crunchy feeling with the twist in. I was like, oh, this is going to be a crunchy twist out. And also when we were doing it, remember we were complaining like, after, about the stickiness. Yeah, the, I don't have that sticky, sticky feeling. We don't yeah. have the stickiness. It's just soft. Usually with main choice, even after you... There is a... Like... I have a, maybe because I'm heavy handed, I have a slight, but not not even really, like a slight, stick, not, not stickiness, but like feeling. Like tacky? Like, uh, like, uh, uh, like very. I think that's just your hands. No, it's not my hands. <laughs> <laughs> she, I think it's she, she doesn't have the, she doesn't have the feeling. Okay. okay. I have a slight bit of something, but. Our hair bow feels very soft. Like, yeah. Ree's hair especially feels very, very soft. So I will say that the leave-in is moisturizing. Granted, it's only two days in. So we don't know if it will last from wash day to wash day. Usually, I like my moisture to last from wash day to wash day. Do you usually have moisture from wash day to wash day? Mm -hmm. Well, I also don't leave my twists out as long as you do because my hair turns into... She's a weave-wearing natural. <laughs> so... <laughs> I, I like moisture from wash day to wash day. I cannot test that because honestly my hair needs to be washed because it's so flaky. Mm -hmm. But the moisture today, it's amazing. The definition is amazing. But I would say Courtney didn't miss the mark with this. But yeah, it, yeah I, I love it for what it did. But I also hate it for what it did as well. Can I do something weird right now? Can I smell your hair real quick? Cause I'm just curious. It smells so good. The products themselves. Don't judge me. Like yeah, I wouldn't mind laying down underneath somebody, man. What is it? Smell good. Oh, you can still smell it. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, some of us. I can't smell it. I can. Plus, it's just you. I can smell it. I can't smell it. I can't oh, smell. Oh my god, we never on the same page. <laughs> I can't smell shit. <laughs> <laughs> I can't smell anything, it's but it's no sweet stuff. She says it smells sweet. It's like a sweet thing, but um, yeah, I I say give it a try. But when Alta opens back up, then you can do returns. You can do returns. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's kind of where I felt. Like I'm gonna try the gel again, and I'll try the leave-in, but I will not try them together. That is my that's my final thoughts. You any final thoughts? Um, I'll try the gel again. Um, but more than likely, I'm just gonna go back to my tried and true because, like I said, I got like the same definition. She, she wears, she uses I, the same product for the last ten if years. If they broke, don't fix it. Preach. If they broke, don't fix it. Because you end up with flakes all through your head. Facts, facts. But thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you, Reese, for trying these products out with me. Thank you, darling. And if y'all. I think it's like for hiding you. I was like, I haven't hit you anywhere. <laughs> I was like, I did not hide you. Um, but that's it. This outro is way long. Um, talk to y'all later. Thanks for watching again. And peace. We're out. <laughs>